problem is here. Stay down. He's known as a master of the fundamentals, boxing's finer points he can critique and he can also refine technique. Jack O'Brien's been sweet on the sweet science since he was a teen. Jack is phenomenal as far as finding strategies for a fight. When Jack speaks up, you shut up. You know, because he doesn't say much, but what he says is like gold. Over the course of 70 years, he's fought and he's taught. I enjoy it, you know. And what's nice about it, when you get good kids that come to the gym, that gives you more momentum. His momentum began in 1944 at school when he joined the boxing team at Superior Cathedral when he was just 14. I did all right for myself, you know. But he had a desire to inspire. Countless amateurs have sat under his learning tree. The amateur program in Superior was very dominant. Jack trained tons of uh, guys that won the Upper Midwest, that went on for collegiate boxing. He's also worked with the pros. Jack, his late wife Shirley, and their family have looked after many a fighter. From advice to home-cooked meals to Jack's guidance in the corner. It's there where he's been the angel on the shoulder to guys like Al Sands, Gary Iyer, Andy Coley, and RJ Loss. He also helped train Zach Jungle Boy Walters during his fight career. He ultimately is the one that changed over my style, the style that brought me into the championship fight. And in a case of life going full circle in the squared circle, Jack now trains kids alongside Zach at the Jungle Boy Boxing Gym. Right now, he's dealing with a sore left leg. I like to be up here catching punches and stuff, but I can't do it until this gets better. Sore leg or not, he won't be working a corner this Friday at Grandma's Sports Garden for a night of Golden Gloves boxing, but he headlines the card. The first annual Jack O'Brien Invitational. Without asking for his approval, we decided to name something after him. He's just, you know, in our way, show thanks. I would not be anywhere I am today if it wasn't for Jack. It's really nice to do that. You know. I really appreciate their loyalty to me. You know, they're really nice. No need to leave it to the judges. Jack O'Brien will win by unanimous decision. For Iwin Sports, I'm Dan Williamson.